Hey, it's Brad here, and we're going to take a look at this bracket that helps you use three of these arms that are not included. They are not included um, in order to extend your backdrop stands capabilities. Um, so the first thing to note is that in case you were somehow confused by the listing where they only cost, I don't know, about $25 for these two sets of, of brackets here, um, you do not get an entire set of backdrop stands and, and these crossbars. So you need to get those elsewhere or already have them. Um, I have various sets of backdrop stands for this purpose. And something that we're going to talk about is why, um, which ones work and which ones don't work well. But anyway, um, I wanted to be able to put multiple layers down. Some, some people have different roles that they want for backdrops. I want multiple layers, um, like a background uh, with curtains out from them and things like that. So that's why I wanted to get this. Um, but let's take a look at it. All right, so you've got this structure here where it comes with these two screw posts on it like that and a little curved bit okay so this is very simple mechanically there's a hole in the middle and then it has two posts there so you can put things uh put these extra bars on there and i was thinking about making this um, myself with just a flat um, thick bar of metal uh, and then screwing some holes in and using some a quarter 20 or 3 8 inch screws um, and washers and wing nuts uh, and then i saw this thing and i thought well, you know what, that would be about my materials costs um, and plus a, a little bit extra for a little bit of labor. So this seems like a good deal to me because um, I didn't have to go and buy the stuff and do the work. All right, so I, um, you can see here there are two different ways of putting on the, the extras here, um, the extra crossbars. Uh, one is to use the wing nut and washer here and the other is just to use this screw to tighten the knob on there now if you put the wing nut and the washer then that's a little bit safer because it, it can't lift off this conceivably if this were a little bit loose it can lift off but it's going to be up high so that's not likely so for my situations i'm comfortable using that there but came with the extra little there also now they just sent this stuff i should take this out it's not included they just sent this whole set of these two there's the other one down there um, these two brackets uh, with the extra wing nuts and washers in a mailing envelope and so i i put it in one of my um, bags that helps hold things together and i put the the brackets in there too um, so the mailing wasn't that great. They weren't even in a plastic bag inside of that. So things could have been lost, but oh well. So what I want to tell you about that's pretty important for you to know is this is a light stand. Okay, this has a post that you that's designed to um, have this knob and the screw uh, go into so it holds on to that um, and it holds lights well and it has a quarter 20 on top, that thread there. Um, whereas backdrop stands, they just have this 3 8 inch thread there. So you see the difference on the bottom part between that one and this one. Now, this one actually came in a, um, as a backdrop stand, but it, it's actually a light stand. So the, the difficulty is... The hole in the middle here that holds this whole thing on here, it's only about 3 8 inch wide, a little bit wider so you can fit a 3 8 inch post through it. So it's not going to fit over one of these light stand posts, which means you've just got a little tiny thread there. So if you want to use a, a light, um, if you want to use this uh, light stand instead of a backdrop stand and turn it into a backdrop stand, then you're probably going to want to get um, like one of these sets of adapters and you'll go from 
uh, you'll have to go through uh, quarter 20 to quarter 20 um, female to female and then get yourself a quarter 20 screw. Otherwise, it's not gonna work very well and it's gonna be pretty dangerous because that's going to be your main post in the middle that holds the whole thing. So you only need one. So that's a big caveat for this kind of thing. All right, and there's just a little bit of room. Um, so this is made okay. I mean, the machining isn't great, uh, but it's not terrible. It does the job just fine. I'm happy with it. it. It seems pretty sturdy. The metal is thick enough. Um, and yeah, it's, it's a pretty simple job and it, it does it just fine. And, and I'm happy with it. I don't think I really have any complaints apart from that shipping and everything, but uh, yeah, it's, it's a good deal if this is what you're looking for because you can put your backdrops way closer together than having multiple backdrop stands where you've got a bunch of spreader legs in the way of each other um, if you don't have C-stands. Um, all right, so that's about it. I think that's what you need to know. I hope it helped.